Hi, this video is going to show you how to, clo um, uh, to clear the history on your username field. Um, if you've ever made this mistake, I've made this mistake before. You see I've already um, I've done that. You could see as I was typing it was bringing up the word password. Where you've typed your password into your username field. Um, and you know, you get to the password field, you realize you made a mistake. So you go back, delete it, and put in your real username, password, and you're in good shape. The problem is, is that history, um, by default, history is turned on for this field. So if someone were to actually get to your machine and just press the space bar, they would be able to see that, oh, there's the username you've been entering, but um, you've accidentally entered your password in the past. And they would know uh, now both your username and password. So the way to disable this is you want to um, hold down the control key, right click, and you see you can disable history. Now, you, there's a second step. You need to also clear your history because that is not that alone is not enough. You'll see if I hit space bar, the history is gone. But again, if someone were to just control, right click, enable history, hit space bar, that history is still there. Um, so what you've got to do is press control, right click, disable history, but then you need to go here to your options and you can see I've already got it expanded but you would expand your local data click on history and clear history and yes okay and now you'll see that um, uh, well I've got it disabled but even if I enable history nothing is there um, so uh, that's that's the way to um, clear anything you've ever put in there and somebody can't bring it back and then what I would recommend is you leave this um, field as disable history um, so, so that um, your password doesn't ever accidentally show up in the username field if you haven't seen that trick before I hope that was helpful and uh, thank you for watching